am Angie. And I'm Princess. And this is your art session. For this week, let's make some popsicle ladybug. Let's check out our paper bag for the materials. In our paper bag, you will find three popsicle sticks. Pre-cut construction paper, red and black paint, and guys, we're going to be needing the wood glue from your previous products. So, let's start working! Hi guys, Princess here. Today we are going to be making the Popsicle Ladybug. So in our project, we will be needing our, go get your three Popsicle sticks. And then your cutout triangle construction paper and your glue. What we're gonna be doing is you go um get grab your three popsicle stick first and form triangle shape to it. So it's gonna be like this. Okay, so what we're gonna do, put glue first. I will put glue here at the very bottom. Remember guys, you guys have the um, wood glue from your previous project, okay? Like so. And then put glue at the very top of both sides. And then here. Okay. And then grab your last popsicle stick, put it on top of that. So now you have your triangle shaped popsicle stick. And then right now, we're going to be putting glue on each side. So the very bottom, two side here, and then the other side. Okay. And then we're going to grab our construction paper. Triangle construction paper. This will serve as the body of the ladybug. Okay, press it like so. So everything will stick together. And then we're gonna flip it. And then wait for it to, to dry, okay? And then, so while it's drying up, we can now get our red paint and your paintbrush and then we will just gonna be painting the popsicle sticks after you guys dried it up you guys get your black paint and from here i'm gonna be using this um wide angled brush to paint the very bottom so um just estimate it um like not half of the line but just the very tip okay so this will serve as like the the face of the ladybug Very easy, very easy project. And after that, I am gonna be getting the thin paintbrush and dip it on my black paint, draw a line in the middle of the body so it should be like this so from here just draw a line going here And then let's not miss the polka dots because every ladybug got a polka dots on their body. Okay. 
this is how your ladybug will look like when you're done working with it i hope we hope you find it easy and fun to work with so we want to see how your projects has turned out please please take your photos and send your photos on the email address up there again this has been angie together with princess always reminding you to wear your mask wash your hands often and keep, keep that, that distance. distance until next time bye y'all